we said to ourselves, well, what is Montreal? We looked at each other. A bell. But it symbolizes the city of Montreal as a city of bells. I have bell ringers and they're like, what do I do? Ring it, I want the bell to fall off the thing. You know, just ring it as hard as you could. You feel it vibrating inside your soul. The other team feels it vibrating in their nightmares. The North Shore Bell is Montreal, as simple as that. And Montreal, having trailed at the break, lead by two goals to one. The idea came into my mind in November 2014, when the Montreal Impact finished last. I said, what can we do different? Should we come up? with a ritual, a goal ritual. It'd be pretty cool. I mean, the climax of a game is a goal. Why not celebrate it? And if there's a victory, man, all the better. We want to start some sort of ritual, like fan base, like supporter base. We need it to be very Montreal, so we threw some ideas around. Snow machines. <laughs> Let's cut up smoked meat at <laughs> a goal. Finally, it was actually Anthony's wife, Sonia. She's like, listen, Montreal's the city of bells. There's cathedrals everywhere. It's very, very, very Montreal. And as soon as she said it, we're all like, whoa, why didn't we think of this before? And I remember the day I, I sat down in the office with administration and I turned the sheet over and he sees this bell and there was silence. And the first thing that happened was the eyebrow went up. I don't know how we're gonna do this. <laughs> I like this. Anthony, just one day, he's like, guys, I bought a bell. And we're like, what? It was a legit bell. The bell is 120 years old. It weighs 1,576 pounds, it's three-quarter ton. Jean-Francois, who's a member of the group, came up with the name L'Etoile du Nord, the North Star Bell. The bell rings when there's a goal and when there's a victory. The bell ringing twice today. We have the ultras, the bell of 1642 brought in the bell. At first, you're like, why a bell? But then you realize, yeah, it could be nice. It could be something that stands out. Uh, we like it. That means when you, are, when you score, this is a sanctuary, kind of like a cathedral. Montreal is known as the city of bells, the city of churches. There are so many churches here in the city. The church bell harkens back to the religious origins of the province of Quebec, highly Catholic, French Catholic, Irish Catholic, but it also ties into what created this city and what this city still represents today. You know, walk in the city or something, and every time there's a bell, you know, from a church or something, uh, first thing that comes to my mind is, is, is there a goal somewhere or something like that? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's, it's special, but uh, honestly, hearing that bell here for me, it's, it's the best sound because it's either you score a goal or we won a game. The first game that we had the uh, bell installed and ready to go was when DJ Drogba scored one goal with his left, one goal with his right, Drogba was the first one to, to actually get the bell going. We were able to get the mayor of Montreal then to the stadium and to ring the bell. So celebrities now, it's uh, who's going to ring the bell next. And uh, most people now who are celebrities in terms of Montreal, who have made it outside of Montreal, it's part of like, yeah, I want to be part of that tradition. I want to be part of the people who have rang the bell. when our former captain, Patrice Bernier, retired, we were able to get his parents to be at the bell. There's a penalty, Piquet. What a send-off this could be in his final game. And I would say that that's probably the most stressful penalty I took. The captain, stutter step, fires, goal! He takes the PK, scores the goal, his mom is ringing the bell. Yeah, I'm getting goosebumps thinking about it. And he was retiring. That was his game where he was retiring. People started talking about it. Players started talking about it with this bell, and then slowly now it's, when you talk about Montreal Impact, you talk about the, the bell. The bell, it gives a, such a, a unique identity to this town. We're very proud about that. For us, it's like heaven when that bell rings. It's the best feeling in the world, and we don't want it to stop. And I know for the opposing team, it's hell. So that's the way we like it. <laughs> <laughs>